Juan Mata joined foundation trustees and representatives from the Premier League and PFA at Stamford Bridge for a celebration of Chelsea's education through football programme. As part of the event, Juan took a Q&A with a selection of lucky children from schools in the local area who take part in the scheme, before signing autographs and taking pictures with his many admirers. I'm just trying to support this, this project. I think Chelsea is doing very, very, good, very well with this kind of, of projects, just trying to help the, the kids. Kids are the future and they deserve everything. I'm very proud uh, with the club because of that. I think kids, uh, most of the kids in London are supporting Chelsea. They, they dream uh, to be in, like a football player playing for Chelsea. And I think it's very good news for them uh, to become a, but to grow as a good person as well. I think it's the most important thing in your life. It's very good, especially because I, uh, I were not involved in every game. I didn't play the semi-final. That was so hard for, for me and for every player who were not involved in the game because we all wanted to, to help. And at the end I had the chance to play 15 minutes in the, in the final, score the goal. I have uh, the two goals against Ireland, so normally with three goals you are not going in the Golden Boot, but it was a very tight tournament. And, and in Spain the, the goals were very uh, shared by the, by the players. Remember, I think four or five players scored twice. And I was more lucky than them, so yeah, everything was uh, strange because normally the player who plays more minutes score more goals, and, or at least they had a chance to score more goals, but it was not my case. And even like this, I could win it, so it was a strange season for me. Is it happy? It is. With Chelsea having signed a new five year deal with official partner Singer last month, some lucky members of the first team were invited down to the world-famous Shepperton Studios. The six players were ushered between two studios to produce both still and video footage that will be used for a campaign throughout Thailand in January. They started by posing for the photographer. Those shots will be used in all sorts of locations from billboards to buses. Everyone watched on for the final choreographed task. Rather than following their natural instincts, the players were told where to move, when to kick and which piece of tape they should end up on. A brief that provoked laughter from all involved. As the day wrapped up and the final group shots were taken, Everyone was happy with how things had gone. And action! Go, guys! Go, go, go! Good! Here's on out to Marco Marin. First chance to see what he can do tonight. Trying to make some room for the shot, but he's well crowded out. Gets it away eventually, but it's blocked by Taylor. Still going Marin, though. Dogged stuff and a great cross into goal! Brilliant! Todd Kane couldn't miss. Marin with one to chase for Bamford. No flag. Strength from Bamford. He's got the better of Gabidon. Oh, brilliant! And Marin scored. Chelsea have their lead back. Marin to Bamford. Bamford shoots. Oh, brilliant goal! Saville up to Marin. Tons of space, and the ball's a good one for Bamford. This is Lewis Baker. Oh, and Price has spilt it all the way in. 4-1. Chelsea looking really good for the win now.